Hi right, guys, welcome to my Persona 5 Royal Shido's Boss Merciless Guide. Yeah, this is Merciless Guide for Shido, he's the boss of the Seventh Palace, and this strategy I'm gonna outline for you guys, it makes it it makes it really it makes it really simple. You can we almost almost auto rush the whole boss apart from about 10% of it, 10%. Um right, let's get into this guys, let's get into this. Um so build. If you've been following my um, daily walkthrough in my palace guide, you should be already built for this. But you, you need, you need. Well, I take Shika with me because you do, you do need a magic dealer um, just for the first part of the fight. This boss has got like five or six um, stages to him, and each stage you'll like he'll um, absorb different attacks, reflect different attacks, he'll do different attacks himself. Um, but you do need a magic dealer for the first part of the fight, and. Um, and the other parts, you can actually do physical for them all. Um, so what I use, I use Shiki. Um, I've got my Shiki here. Um, as you can see, he covers... You don't need to cover all attacks like that. You don't need to cover all attacks like that. Um, but he does anyway, so that's how I've built him up. He's got max all skills. That probably don't. That probably doesn't matter too much. Um, so we've got Shiki. He's my magic dealer. And the other one you want... Now, you really need this persona... Um, it's Gary McCalla. He he repels gun and physical. He doesn't normally repel um, uh, curse and bless. He's actually weak to bless, and he normally nulls curse. But I've put re I've put repel bless and curse on him there. Um, you want firm stance on him, instant heal, and you want regenerate one, two, and three. Invigorate three doesn't really matter. That's optional. You want regenerate one, two, and three, and you want the trait demon spite. Demon spite. I'm going to put a um, a little guide up on the screen. Just what personas I use to fuse him because we need Demon's Bite trait and you can only get that from Ongio on on Ongioki. You can only get that from that persona. So you need Demon's Bite. Um, he repels for he repels um, physical gun and um, bless and curse. And setup wise, I actually do this. I do do a solo, but you can't you can't unequip your team for this fight. If you unequip them all here when you go into the fight, they're already you already have three teammates active. It just it's just what happens in big boss battles. Um, but my equipment, so I've got a base lard, that's the strongest weapon you can get at this point. Um, you actually purchase that from Airsoft Shop and Protector Tantric, Tantric Oath R. You actually get that from, you get that from Itemizing, Itemizing Satan during a fusion alarm. And Captain Badge, you should get that from the um, one of the big band challenges. <clears throat> but there's an accessory you can buy from the Underground Mole, which does the same thing. And basically what that does, it increases your health by 30 percent 30 percent um <clears throat> excuse me and there you go increase your health by 30 percent and that'll really help really help with the regeneration because it'll mean you'll regenerate a lot more right let's go and do it guys let's go and show shido let's go and show him how i can auto rush the whole battle we are merciless we are merciless and some of his attacks they do hit very they do hit very hard but with time he does an attack like that again you would have healed all your health back with this build, you'll be healing about 100, 150 HP each each turn, each turn, each turn. And what I, what I will do, because um, we're just going to be auto rushing the whole battle. I'm I'm likely there'll be some parts I'm, I may skip ahead because all we're going to be we're just going to be auto rushing the fight. I'm, I may skip ahead to when he sort of changes changes his attacks a little bit, just so I can walk, walk you through what might happen next or what will happen here. So first stage, first stage of the battle, first stage of the battle. He's going to be in this. He's going to be in this form. He's got all them. I don't know what this is. It's sort of. It's just made of load of bodies, load of bodies. Um, but first, he's a beast of human sacrifice. And first of all, all you can damage him with is magical attacks. Now, I do not worry about any teammates. I want them to get killed. I want them to get killed. Um, they'll still get XP at the end, even if they're dead. Um, I think Persona 5, the first one, that if they're dead, they didn't get anything. But in this one, they do seem to get XP when they die. Or maybe it's just boss, uh, big boss battles, I don't know. But they will get XP at the end of this. So don't worry about any buffs. Don't worry about it, guys. Just make sure you're Shiki, your magic dealer. He he knows physical and gun and um, bless and curse. So just any any magic attack, you just want to keep hitting him with magic attacks now until, until um, he changes his face. So same with your teammates. Just get them to do magic attacks. Their strongest magic attacks. Um, he'll reflect physical and gun. Yeah, he's going to do a lot of damage on most of his teammates, but 
don't worry about it. <laughs> we're we're good. So another um, arm. What have you got? Heavy. Yeah. I think we're we're level level si about level 67 range in about that area. Um, I'm not going to bother using concentrating that. Um, it's not really any need. Not really any need. All right, back to Joker. So just keep doing magical attacks until he changes his stage. Basically, his next stage, he'll start to fly, and then we can use physical attacks against him. You've only got to take away about a quarter of his health. It won't. It won't take you too long. It won't take you too long. Um, don't worry. Don't worry about all the debuffs he's going to cast on you. It's not going to affect Joker because of the personas we're using. It'll affect. <laughs> it'll affect your teammates, but who cares? Who cares about them in this battle? They can stand on the sidelines and watch. Watch how we do it solo. So hopefully, hopefully that's enough damage. I'm hoping. Oh, not quite yet. Maybe when it gets back to his turn again. Uh, Beast King's Wrath. <laughs> yeah, so they're almost there, they've all got 1 HP. Because we've got instant heal, you don't need to worry about get, um, yourself getting inflicted with ail um, ailments because you'll recover them after one turn. Yeah, eat my eat my lightning. Let's feed the bigger. I uh, create evasion up. Yeah, so Anne's Anne is out. So just keep attacking him. Come on, he's got a change face soon. Come on beast of human sacrifice. I think my enemies were my allies were inflicted with rage, that's why they're attacking automatically. So now he's going to change his face. He should start flying. There we go. He turned into a winged beast of sacrifice now. He changed. The wings of human sacrifice. So now what we're going to do, ask Joker, we're going to switch Emergency shift. Yeah, don't worry. Don't call anybody. Don't worry. We want everybody to be dead. So, ask Joker. Now we're going to switch to Gary McCalla. Yeah, I know I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. We're going to switch to him now. Now, once you switch to him, now we're just going to auto rush the rest, the rest of the fight. Don't worry. We're just going to auto rush the rest of the fight. Don't worry. You will be, you'll be recovering health quicker than what it gets taken off you. Don't worry. You'll be what are we getting? We we should be getting about 150 a turn. We should be healing. Um, don't worry about getting hit with buffs or anything yourself, debuffs, because like I say, you will heal from it really quick. And the de the detox skill from Counselor will help you as well. To like that will help you to heal instantly as well. Ryu is hanging on pretty well. Ryu is hanging on pretty well. So that's what I like about the repels. You'll you'll be repelling damage back at him, and it'll just help speed up the fight a bit. And it's not doing much at the moment because he resists most of it. How is Ryu still standing? He's doing well. He he is doing pretty well. Well done, Ryu. Well done, man. You have surprised me. Uh, he's dead now. He's got to be there. <laughs> Finally, Ryu's gone. Finally, I can do it all myself. One man, one man army. He will, he will do their magic attacks, and like I say, one, it, it may debuff you with an ailment. But like I say, you should heal up straight away via either detox or instant heal. So don't worry, don't worry. Um, so so simple like this, so simple. Yeah, so we're st <laughs> we're still going. So this is part where I say I'm probably going to edit it out a bit. Just leave it like that, guys. You're fine. Don't worry. He will do strong attacks sometimes, but you will you'll you'll heal before you actually take too much damage. Um, so he's going to change the face again. Now he's going to turn into pyramid. Now there is one thing I want to say about the pyramid. There is one attack which takes a lot of damage off you, like about 400 or so, and it can get a bit close with that one. So what I like to do there, just to be safe, is He'll do his cannon fire. He'll do it twice, and then they'll. Once he's done it twice, he'll like. He'll do it twice, and then he'll do his unholy convergence. When he does that, when he's charging up, just um, block, just block on that one, just to be on the safe side, because otherwise he's going to do about 400 damage to you. And it's just to be on the safe side, just make sure you do heal up in time. But if you. Yep, here it comes. Pyramid Blast. 
Yeah, but as long as you're blocking, it only does about, yeah, 140, 140 um, damage. And then you can go back into auto rush. Going back into auto rush. Yeah, because this stage, it does do quite a lot of damage. So yeah, just keep doing that. He'll charge up. When he when it gathers light around the turret, block. There you go. So you take less damage. That that's the only attack where it that's the only one where it can get close. You can sometimes power through it with auto rush, but like I said, it, it, it gets a little. Sometimes it gets a little bit gets a little bit too close for comfort. So yeah, it's just a good idea to um, block during that. Once you just initiate it, you can only get one more one attack in before you have to block. And there we go. Um, once you've taken out Pyramid, he will you'll you'll actually face his true form, um, Shido himself. You'll face him in the flesh. And once he comes out, fights like a man. Yeah, what she what she give me a uh, party attack up. Nice. Unholy Convergence. Okay, this should be the last time I'm hoping. Come on, Joker. Smash smash that pyramid to bits. Cannon fire. Yeah, it's... This is on Merciless, so... This is the hardest it'll be. If you're using this build on EC... <laughs> I, I don't know what you're doing. If you're using this build on easy, you're just gonna destroy the game. But I mean, it may it makes it easy enough on merciless, merciless. So now he's gonna be Shido, and you're good. You're good. None of his attacks will be as strong as that pyramid. The pyramid seems to be his strongest attacks. Um. So all we're gonna do now is just auto rush. You shouldn't need to block for anything else. Anything else? Just auto rush, mate. Your allies will we they'll um respawn here with one health so just auto rush let him die and um, I think here as well I think you'll go back to your persona yeah you'll go back to whatever you had selected before battles so you may need to go back and switch to um, switch to Gary McCalla you may need to go back and switch to him and here we go some of his attacks do do a lot of damage but you'll be reflecting them back at, you'll be reflecting them back at him bloodbath So that seems inflicted it inflicted some of us with fear. Shido he'll have he'll have another stage. He's got this stage, then he's got another stage, and then he'll be dead. The Harmonculus. <laughs> the Harmonculus. That STD sacrificed himself. Uh, oh no, it's one food to the final guard. I just want all my allies getting died, get killed, get died it. Because then it'll become easier then. It'll become quicker. Oh, so there's uh, Morgana and Anne. They're out. They're out. No, do not bother exchanging your allies because you want them all to die. Because then it'll go by quicker. Ryu's holding on again. He's holding on again. Oh, he died a bit quicker that time. But he held it on longer than anybody else. So there we go. He's, his health is going down pretty, pretty quick. Pretty quick. I thought like I thought I was gonna have to edit some of this out, but it seems it seems I don't really need to because it, it's going it's going by pretty pretty quick. Yeah, it's going by pretty fast. Yeah, his almighty tax can do a lot of damage, but you should heal it all up before before him. Um, he gets a chance to do a strong attack again. Tyrant's fist, <laughs> yeah. Come on, hit me with Tyrant's Fist. Let me repel. Let me repel that back at you. He's, put, he's basically punching himself, isn't he? He's basically punching himself. Bloodbath. Uh, that's that. The Almighty One, yeah, you can't block. It's a shame there's nothing you can block Almighty with. <laughs> Punch himself again. you got to stop doing that, Shido. Punching yourself. <laughs> right, he's going to change form now. He's going to go into um, rage mode. 
Oh, look at him. Fistler North Star with no hair. What one? What attack is that? 291. Yeah, he hit himself. He hit himself with that. So this is his last stage. Once you got through this, that's it. The battle is finished. The battle is finished. And yeah, he will he will do some magical attacks now. Um I mean magical like your you know your main elements like fire and ice and that. He may do some lemon attacks now, but it's no, nothing to worry. He will charge sometimes, but again, nothing nothing to worry about. Charge, heat riser, and then an attack. He'll do that little combination, but nothing nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. Because <laughs> he'll he will inflict it back at himself. You complete, you prick, you prick, you know. Well, at least that AI isn't, it's not at the point where they can adapt from what you're doing. Adapt from what you're doing, so. It, it lets you keep keep doing this to him. Just take it, taking the piss, taking the Michael. But he keeps, he keeps falling for it. Yeah, there we go, lightning. If you do get hit by a debuff, again, just don't worry. You will heal. You will heal from it quick enough. Don't worry. I think most of the damage has come from uh, Shido punching himself. Did he just tell me to stay down? <laughs> Funny man. Funny. Tyrant's glare. This is a strong attack. <laughs> Start punching yourself! Okay. This one look this one looks dangerous. Ooh. I don't know, we'll find out in a second. He's probably just hurt himself. I know, let's repel his attacks. Don't worry, Futa Bear, it's, un it's under control. Panta Ray, Panta Ray. Oh, okay, that one hurt me a little bit. <laughs> Tyrant's Judgment. That's going to hurt him. 288, he just inflicted on himself. Inferno, what's that? Fire? Is that fire? Gary McCalla, he, he resists. He is actually strong to fire, so he won't take as much damage to it. Diamond Dust, that's ice, severe damage, ice attack. Tyrant's Judgment, what's that? What damage is that going to do? 2225. Two, Damn, Shido, you're making this quite quite easy for me. Thunder Rain. That's probably the strongest thunder attack. So I'm inflicted with shock now, but you, like I say, you'll use, you will heal from it really quick. I healed from that instantly with Detox. With Detox Detox is actually a skill you get from um, getting ranked 10, uh, rank 10 with a counsellor. It's actually it's actually a really good skill. It's actually a really good skill. When it was triggering, I, I was wondering what it was. Detox? I was thinking, what's that? And I had to, I had to look through everything to try and figure out what it was. Um, but that's it, guys. Really, I mean, can can I make it any easier for you, Merciless? Can we make it any easier? He was, You're basically making the boss punch himself, damage himself. Um, but that is it guys, that is the Shido boss fight, Shido boss, um, Shido, he's from the Shido palace. Uh, I hope it helped guys, um, I'll see you back on my um, daily walkthrough, or I will see you possibly on new, another video, or once we get to, once we get to um, the end of December. So thanks for watching guys, and I will see you on the next video.